Okay. All right, so we're back. Bullshit. Fucking kidding me. I'm trying to avoid these freaking things. Be very careful where I run. You can suck my left nut. You can suck it. Go up here. Go up. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Yo, I feel like these things are gonna kill me if I'm not careful. That's a cool little thing though, like, uh, to bring items to me, I all I gotta do is to... Is, um... Uh... I forgot what I was saying. All, all I have to do is just use dust, use the dust storm to, um... To... Uh, I think I'm gonna go the other way. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Let's go the other way. Fuck that. Fuck, no, 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 no. Go down. Wait, there's a treasure there, though. Shit! Ah, oh, I gotta go. Well, at least I... There's a save point. Uh. Yeah, I need to get blown up by something stupid. I wish I knew where the fuck this thing... Where this place goes. Like, I really just wish... Oh, and there's a slide thing up there, so that probably has something to do with the treasure. But I have no way of using that stupid resonance thing. I have it. Like, I have it, but it won't open for me. that vine crap that I can't climb. You know what's gonna be the fun part? Getting back down from this fucking mountain. That's gonna be the fun part. I'm coming up here out of curiosity and I'm thinking it was a waste of fucking time. 
Okay. No, I really am thinking right now it's a waste of fucking time that I came up here. Fucking hit that corner, and there they were. Oh shit, I fell. Shit, get back up. The hell? Whoa, uh, hello there. making all that noise up there uh, not intentionally uh, by the way do you know you have bloms in the attic <laughs> oh, those? they don't bother us and they tend to keep the other monsters away if I knew we were having company I'd have cleared them out myself sorry about that I guess Wow what an asshole so what brings you to this far outside Aurora I'm assuming that's where you're from I'm Dust, and this is my companion, Fidget. We're here to deliver these materials on Augustine's behalf. Oh, well, nice to meet ya. I'm Haley, and this is my brother, Maddie. Haley and Maddie. Do all the names in this game fucking rhyme in some way, or mean in so, uh, or have a meaning in some sixth sense? Like, don't mind him. I see you've got a blueprint there. Mind if I take a look? Well. This doesn't look too hard. Tell you what, if you can find me the materials for it, I'll craft this item for you. Uh. Oh, fuck! The one time I'm like, oh, let's sell something. Oh, you motherfucker. You sons of bitches. You mother... F <laughs> it's like, wow. Oh, I only have two more. Wow. Thanks, Haley. And, uh, just because I like you... I'll give you a blue resonance gem. Don't know if you caught it on your way up, but there's a big blue door at the foot of Archer's Pass that this will open. Just inside the door is a teleporter that'll take you right up here. Makes return trips a lot easier. So you can come and visit anytime you like. I have no idea, but I feel like she's hitting on me. I'll be honest, even with the shortcut at the foot of the pass, I'm not sure I'll be able to make it up here too often. Hmm, well, my dad did have these little receiver things he'd give to his regular customers to transport goods back and forth. Unfortunately, I don't have any of them to give you. Let me think. If I remember correctly, one of my dad's customers dropped one somewhere in Abadi's forest. If you were to find it, I could craft your items and send them to you through the receiver whenever you want it. Dad normally gives his customers a blue resonance gem. So check the Blue Resonance Gates in Abadi's forest. Need anything else? So, let's talk. I notice it's only you and Maddie up here in the pass. Is it just you two? Not all the time, no. My father still runs the forge, but he's usually away on business. Right now, he's somewhere across the sea, hunting down new minerals and ores. He's always trying to make better weapons and armor. Sounds like he's always pretty busy. Yeah, but I get along fine by myself. And Maddie too, of course. I meant to ask before. Does Maddie have a problem with me? What? Well, he's just... He seems to grumble a lot around me. <laughs> I can attest to that. Lots of grumbling. 
I really can't say, Dust. Maddie, do you have anything to say? Yeah. Well, I hope that answers your question. Uh, not really, but... Just let it go. Wow. So, is blacksmithing the official family trade, then? In a way, I guess. My father said I could be whatever I wanted. But when you grow up alongside a world-famous blacksmith, your options are fairly limited. You can be whatever you want. Yeah, that's the type of shit you want to tell your kids. So they'll grow up with low with low expectations and end up being a stripper. Yeah, that's what you want to tell your kids. You can be anything you want. You can't just hit them with the real hard facts like go for one thing, do what you love to do. You may not know it now, but do what but you'll will and just pursue that. Go for your dreams. Don't try to be everything. Just be one thing. And please, for the love of God, don't come back to my house with a stripper name like like Diamond. I'm gonna have to fuck you up. That's what I, that's what I tell my kid. It's nice to have skills that are in demand these days. Everybody always needs something forged, whether it's amulets or armor. So business is good. <sighs> it's well, it's been better. Still. We make enough to keep things going, and that's the important thing. Your forge is pretty far off the beaten path, Haley. Why set up shop so far outside Aurora? This forge is actually quite ancient. My father's 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 father inherited it from his mother's grandfather on her father's side. Okay. No. No. Fuck you. Fuck that logic. It was built during the Battle of Archer's Pass. Many hundreds of years ago, the archers were holding off their enemies from way up here. But they needed a forge to replenish their arrows. So they built one right where they stood. It helped them take archers' paths. And from here, they were able to liberate a whole valley. Sounds like this forge has a lot of history behind it then. Even so... Location, location, location. Damn fucking straight. <sighs> yeah, I hear what you're saying. I wish it was more accessible. You'd get more business, I'm sure of it. But it's not like we can just pick it up and move it. I'll bet if you had an army of trained rats, you can loot this place no problem. Where the fuck is the logic in that? Wait, let's move some rats around. Yeah, that's a good fuck. You're stupid! Fidget's not only fidgety, but a retarded ass! Uh, Fidget's... I don't think that'd help. And ding ding ding! Dust is a smart man! You know, smart mutant rats with magic! Does such a thing exist? I don't think so. Don't worry about her dust. Altitude sickness. Drive some creatures crazy. Fidget was pretty crazy before. Maybe we should be on our way. Need anything else? Thanks, Dust. Don't be long coming back. Okay. That went incredibly well. The I don't know, Fidget. Why? Oh, um, don't be so dense. It's because she likes you. No shit. Fidget, what are you talking about? You didn't see the signals? She was giving you the signals! What sig- Oh my god. That's great, Fidget. Really, I'll keep that in mind. <laughs> wow. Jesus Christ, man. Holy shit. There's something over here in the glade, so... We might as well go back this way. Why is it dark? Why did it get dark all of a sudden? What the hell happened? Uh, 
Oh, whatever. Oh, let me stop the footage because I just realized it's 15 minutes long. Damn, that is... Well, I gotta keep track of the time.